Hey, what up Long Beach? Welcome back to the 562.org. It's Tyler and this boys basketball highlight is brought to you by the fine folks down at Naples Rib Company and all of our coverage of Long Beach Poly this season is sponsored by Bryson Financial. Thanks to all of our sponsors and welcome to Westchester High School for the first game that we're covering of the boys basketball season in Long Beach. The tip off classic here right next to LAX. JoJo battle in this one starting with superstar junior Giovanni Ruff for the Jackrabbits. And then on the other side for the Saints, sophomore JoJo Wicker for St. Anthony. Excited to see what he does this year. Head coach Alan Mitchell has done a great job with this program, as has coach Shelton Diggs, who's looking for a bounce back season for the Jackrabbits. And let's not wait any longer. Let's tip this thing off. Basketball season is back in Long Beach. And uh, had had season opener vibes early as each team came out cold. They started a combined 0 of 11 from the floor and finally senior Quincy Williams breaks the seal with this tray ball not his last bucket of the night spoiler alert and if the ball's not going in sometimes you just gotta force it Giovanni Ofebu with the slam for Polly I'd love to see that then Ruff taking it to the rim gliding in to give Polly the early lead but the Saints would hit their groove Wicker knocks down the three ball then on the drive it's gonna be a three-point play for Phillips as he goes hard to the 10, Saints starting to uh, get some separation. Saints also getting it quickly in transition. An easy run out for Kupiski. Finger roll at the rim. Then Wicker steps into another three. The Saints hit five triples in the first quarter. Ruff with the ball in his hands doing a nice job finding his spots and racking up points for the Jackrabbits. But it was tough for them to get a foothold. Deuce Lloyd from the corner looking like Trey Lloyd from Beyond the Arc. The bench is loving that. And then with the clock winding down in the first quarter, Wicker hits his third three of the quarter to beat the buzzer, and it's 23-10 Saints after the first eight minutes. So they came out firing, and they're in a good spot early. Jackrabbits would take advantage of their size in the second quarter. Jonas Oware with the offensive rebound, and Ruff would splash the triple. Then off the entry pass, Oware able to score the bunny down low. But whenever Polly started to get going, St. Anthony had the answer. Phillips from deep. I'm just a gangsta, I suppose. And I want my corners. As he hits from both sides, uh, Phillips just cooking all night long. Austin Unegbu, straight away three, the other way for Polly. But like I said, they couldn't really sustain any momentum. St. Anthony got some easy points from their defense tonight. Donovan Pitts with the steal and the lay. Then with the first half clock winding down, Phillips, nowhere to go. Might as well give a heat check. Bang! A backbreaker for Polly as it looked like he had nowhere to go. Knocks down the three. Eight threes for St. Anthony in the first half. Two of them buzzer beaters. Phillips had 17 as they're up 39-24. Jackrabbits would still battle after half as Ruff is going to can the triple right there. Then it's sophomore Nana Ofebu drives hard for the and one. Nana was a great spark off the bench, really quick with the ball. Excited to see him this year. Uh, but the Saints did a nice job generating good looks inside. Great dime from Darius Williams. Then, even off a miss, look at Phillips with the tip drill. He scored in a lot of different ways tonight. And in transition, Amon, no fear, Zavahir, and the foul. <laughs> Great play, taking it up hard to the rim, finishing through the contact. Giovanni would obviously continue to get off. He's got, that's a three-point play for the junior there. Then in transition, great body control on the floater. 30 points tonight for Giovanni Ruff. But the Rabbits couldn't get any closer. Phillips with the and one just going point for point with one of the state's best players on the other side. And a good save by Chandler Young, setting it up for Williams to score. Saints getting a lot of different guys involved. Wicker with a nice feed to Amon Haynes to score inside. Then off the Phillips feed, it's Haynes again. He finished with 11, one of four St. Anthony players to get into double figures. Saints defense keying in on Ruff, as you'd expect. Williams going to step in for the steal. He would drop the dime to Phillips. He also racked up a 30-piece in this one. And finally, a wicker basket from downtown LA. 13 points for JoJo as the Saints take this one in impressive fashion. 85-59 your final. 
St. Anthony will face Paramount on Monday, while Polly is back in this gym taking on Westchester on Friday night. We're excited for the winter sports season here in the LBC, and if you want all the coverage, hoops and otherwise, you're definitely in the right place. The562.org.